Hey everyone, Tenrils all here, and today I would like to discuss the new game modes that have recently come to Battlefield 2042. So Battlefield 2042 has added two new game modes, 64 player conquest and 64 player breakthrough for current gen systems. These are of course smaller scale versions of two game modes that have been available to portal mode since launch. They come with normal experience and normal weapon locks because these are official matchmaking options now. Conquest is what it has always been just with 64 players. Breakthrough is a fun mode where you have the defending team guarding objectives, the attacking team has to take them, the attacking team has a certain number of tickets, and the defending team has an infinite number of tickets. I played it, it's really fun, it's fast paced, and yeah, I had a good time with it. DICE also announced that the official rush on 2042 maps playlist is staying in the game through the holiday season. This was initially added just as a one week limited time deal, but it seems like DICE is listening to the players who really wanted it to be a permanent addition to the game. Now, there's no guarantee it's going to be permanent, but this is an extension, so it is a good sign for those of you who enjoy Rush. Also, side note, DICE is working on 24 new UI customization options, whatever that means, and they are, sadly, removing the ability to place C4 or C5? whatever they call it, on the recon drone. And lastly, you've got some bugs that they are working on since the most recent update. The more notable ones are when dead bodies block bullets. You're still having the issue where your loadout is missing on the redeploy screen. And then there's this new fun bug where the screen flickers when you're downed and it has been reported to be causing epileptic seizures. You're also still getting invisible players and vehicles here and there, and multiple issues related to movement inputs. Fixes for these issues are expected, of course, to roll out over the game's next few updates. Not sure when those will be, of course, considering DICE is not expected to push out any more updates between now and the end of the year. That's going to do it for today's Battlefield 2042 update video. Make sure you drop a thumbs up if you enjoyed my content. It helps with the algorithms. Make sure you're subbed to the channel for more content. And leave me a comment down below. Let me know your experience with Battlefield 2042. For me, it's getting better and better. I'm very happy to admit that. I'm having fun. Some of these games are really intense, very fast paced. It feels like it's working better overall. So let me know your thoughts on that. I'm out guys. I will see you on the next one.